One of the challenges that we face in leadership at all levels of the church today is there are so many demands on our time. And I'm grateful for this opportunity to come and be a part of this Mission Holiness Conference because I'm honestly leaving here feeling that this was a wise investment of my time. The conference really is the uh, epitome of putting feet to the holiness message, how our actions uh, revolve around the message that we say we have as, uh, as holiness people. This is a great event uh, to be reminded, to learn, and to be challenged uh, to go and to make an impact in this 21st century. Uh, at the Missional Holiness Conference, there's people there's people that are doing missional holiness and we want to hear from them, I want to learn from them and uh, to, to be able to meet with other pastors that are, we're all just trying to figure this thing out. One of the things I love about the Mission of Holiness Conference is to be reminded that missional living and holiness come together. And it's a good reminder for me and a great way to help encourage the entire church to continue to grow in that, in that missional holiness uh, to reach our world for Him. There's no other conference in our denomination like it. And I was delighted that God had placed this on the heart of Dwight Michael, And he has been uh, looking at this, planning this, working with this, trying to figure out how to do this. And I believe God has called Dwight to lead that in the Wesleyan Church.